Think electric vehicles can't be sexy. Think they're just for lentil-munching soy boys? Think car companies are propagating the myth that EVs are the key to saving the planet in order to divert blame for the climate crisis onto individual consumers? Well, think again. Or better yet, don't think at all. Introducing the Rajvolt Don't Think, Just Drive sales event. Our lineup of electric vehicles has something for everyone, from the granola yuppie. See that little leaf in the logo there? That's important to me. To the tech bro. I'm pretty much the modern day Thomas Edison. My friends call me that, not as a joke. Even exhausted parents with a constant internal hum of climate anxiety. Who has time to save the planet when soccer practice starts in 10 minutes? Want to feel better about the environment and yourself? Then you want an electric vehicle. Don't think. Don't think. Get in the car, now. Just drive. We've spent a fortune on nostalgic IP and picture quality visual effects to distract your monkey brain from all that thinking. Get behind the wheel of an all new Rajvolt Gaia while Smokey the Bear gets a tug job from Groot, if that's what it takes. Or try the high tech Rajvolt Futura with charging time so fast, you'll wonder how we managed to shove a catheter up the almighty urethra of Zeus himself. Put the pedal to the metal in a Rajvolt Planeteer with torque so powerful, it'll feel like you're getting bottomed by Captain Goddamn Planet. Just do yourself a favor. Don't think about the fact that production of an EV emits 70% more greenhouse gases than that of a gas-powered car and it'll take nearly a decade of driving to offset those emissions. Don't think. And don't think about all the DIY lithium miners freelancing for the Taliban, who you're essentially financing by buying this car. Don't think. And definitely don't think about the staggeringly unregulated process of lithium ion battery production, the South African miners getting neurological diseases from huffing manganese dust, the assembly facilities built suspiciously close to forced labor camps in China. Can't think, gotta drive. Good, big oil and the ruling class have conspired to make you believe the climate crisis is all your fault. And the only way out of this mess is through consuming even more. Electric vehicles are a capitalist friendly way for granola yuppies to do their environmental virtue signaling, for tech bros to feel intellectually superior, and for anxious parents to feel like they're building a better tomorrow, the same way they built their wealth, passively. Look, is this shit gonna save the planet or not? Actually, it might. Synthetic fuels, sulfur-based batteries, hydrogen-powered engines, once they're properly developed, these could solve a lot of humanity's problems. But currently, they ain't. So this toxic cocktail of trendiness and well-intentioned legislation is causing EV production to balloon before the technology is perfected, deepening the chasm we so desperately need to drag our collective asses out of. But. That's for scientists and politicians to think about, not you. A solution is coming, but I need your money now. So remember, no think, only drive. Less thinky, more drivey. What do you mean you forgot your jock strap? Don't think, just drive. I've been Roger. No, we are not turning back now.